Neuropathic pain <coughs> or nerve-related pain is pain as a direct consequence of injury to nerves. Uh, the type of word that patients tend to use when they are experiencing neuropathic pain include electric. Uh, it can it can also one can also use the word burning. Uh, one can also use the the general term of unpleasant sensation, which might include pins and needles type feeling. All these words tend to relate to neuropathic type pain. Uh, the treatment of neuropathic type pain include the possible administration of medications. In particular, one can use anti-neuropathic medication. This medication is aimed at trying to dampen down or what we say is turning the volume of the nerve pain down uh, so that it is at a much tolerable level. In most cases, these medications are started off at a low dose uh, to make sure that the side effects are tolerated, and these can include sleepiness or drowsiness. Um, but in particular, these are then sort of titrated up slowly to make sure that the side effects and the benefits are weighed equally against each other. Other types of treatments uh, might include patches, and these can normally be cut out and placed over the problematic area. These can be given to the patient in particular for them to try at home. However, there are other types of patches, such as capsaicin patches, that can be done within a theatre setting and placed directly over the problematic area, and normally they are left there for a number of minutes, be it 20 to 30 minutes. This, in this way, what happens is that the reduction in the nerve pain is normally seen within this time, and this procedure then can be repeated uh, at, a, at a number of months' time, in a number of months' time. Other treatments for this type of pain can include injection therapy, and that basically involves the administration of local anaesthetic as well as steroid in and around the irritated or damaged nerve. The medication that normally works is, is steroid and it's a low dose, uh, low dose uh, that is given and it normally involves it being placed within a theatre, in, in a theatre setting. So that might involve some sedation, normally under some form of imaging, which might include ultrasound or under an x-ray guidance and it is then suitably placed with a with a small needle in and around the irritated nerve. What we normally see is that there is some benefits with, with the steroid uh, application and sometimes, if necessary, this procedure can be repeated.